Hi, this is Galen Thomas Ramos with my Project One. Um, this is the opening screen. Uh, when you open it first, there's no data that shows up. Um, all of the filters are turned on, so everything's filtered and it, it, it won't show, it won't graph. Um, but you can click on the different tabs here to switch your graphs. Um, the y-axis is uh, interpolated too, so just to help with transitioning the graphs, um, I'll show you what I'm talking about in a second. Uh, but if you wanted to show something, you would uh, go over here to the left, and there are these tabs uh, with the different regions on them. Uh, and within each region, I have uh, color-coded each country um, to uh, a different gradient. And um, originally what I was going to do is have the first ten countries be a solid color, and then the rest of the countries, if they're within the same region, uh, they, would be, they would be colored with a pattern. Um, I couldn't get that to work, uh, so it, it just doesn't, it's not there right now. But um, yeah, you just click through the different tabs and it'll show you the filters, the countries that you can filter. But um, if you want to, you know, enable something, let's enable, uh, let's do um, North America. So this is the region of North America, um, and according to this uh, data here, uh, this is, um, Th this um, this green right here is the uh, all of the incorporated re all of the incorporated countries that make up this region. Uh, this is that. So it's, it's all of these countries aggregate. So if you wanted to look at one country one at a time, I layered the the graphs uh, so that the one with the smallest total would be in the front and the one with the biggest total would be in the back. That way you can see all of the graphs at one time. So nothing's being hidden because of that. Um, so if you want to, uh, th this button right here will uh, um, disable all of the filters. So, um, and this one does the opposite. It, it enables all the filters, including the region. Um, so if you wanted to go through this graph right here, total primary energy consumption, um, you could just click through the tabs. Uh, you know, if you want to know more about Asia's primary energy consumption, um, let's find Hong Kong. Nope, doesn't work there. Okay, so this is the all button. So this will enable all the filters. So I can see right away all of the countries within the uh, Asia and Oceania uh, region um, are enabled. So over here, this is probably this this top one. This is probably all of them. So that's all of the Asia and Oceania region um, aggregate. And then, uh, unfortunately, right now with my program, you can't choose. Yeah, OK, so there's China. Um, so yeah, you just click on the different countries in here, and it'll turn on and off the country. Um, but let's see here. So if we want to go to a different graph, you can keep the countries there without having to turn the filter off, and it will interpolate over. Um, uh, there's the world uh, graph, so you, if you want to make comparisons to um, other things. Uh, and there, the, the, the per capita graphs, um, those follow uh, averages as far as like region, um, the region entries in the uh, data spreadsheet. So there is no world, the world doesn't show up here. Um, because there's only one world that you can't average that out um, and the same with Antarctica but with um, let's see here okay so this is yeah so you can enable each country there and um, yeah as you can see uh, the data is interpolated it's animated uh, but as I was saying before I, I animated the uh, or interpolated the uh, y-axis measure um, so that uh, when you change the graphs, this what what just happened right there, right here, this um, goes away quicker. It'll interpolate it and follow it. It'll be smoother. Um, I couldn't get it to go away completely, um, but yeah, uh, that's pretty much the program. Um, this key right, this icon right here. Uh, when I add keyboard functionality, if you would press this, it would make a menu right here, and then you know you could search for the country uh, that way. Um, so yeah, thank you. Bye.